Hi, this is Steve Finn. Today, we're going to be looking at the Drum Set Musician by Rod Morgenstein. This page that we're looking at today is page 11, and it focuses mostly on beginner drum set rock grooves. These grooves can be used in any Western style of music, primarily rock, hip-hop, uh, country, you know, pretty much any style like that. Um, these beats are very fundamental to a beginner student and often the very first thing I teach in the studio. Um, these grooves are all very similar in that the hi-hat and the snare drum patterns are all the same. However, and, and those being uh, eighth notes on the left side and quarter notes on the right side, two and four in the snare between all of them. Um, what's different though is between each example is the bass drum variations. These variations are a very good way to accent the band, particularly the bass player and the different changes that go on. These are different ideas that can be used and all of them work equally well within a band setting. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play down the A side of the page, pause, and then I'll play the B side of the page. In order to read this, all you need to do is look vertically from the hi-hat, starting from the top, looking down. So in example one, you have beat one, which is hi-hat, and then directly below it is bass drum. Then the next eighth note is a hi-hat. All you need to know to play this is to play what's on top of each other at the same time. So to start, slowly, we'll play number one. The first beat on one is just hi-hat and bass drum, so stop. Doesn't matter how long this takes. Then just a hi-hat, just an eighth note. Then two. All I'm doing is reading the page as it is one note on top of, each of the other. Any notes that come on top of each other are just played together. It doesn't matter how long it takes or how slow you take it, you know, that's what's important. The, the longer you work on this, the more it'll start, stop being so slow and the more you'll start to hear. Okay, so as an example, I'm going to play numbers 1 through 7 up to tempo on the A side. Then I'm going to pause and play the B side. Two measure, uh, they have repeat signs with them too. So I'm going to play them each twice through. Pause and then play the other side twice through. Examples all work really well in a beginner style, in, in a beginner type musical scenario. They're all equally good, just sort of depends on the situation that you're in. Um, these next examples on the B side all have the same bass drum and snare drum um, as the, the A side. The only difference is now instead of eighth notes on your ride source or hi hat, um, they're now quarter notes. Um, this is good for, as where the A side was good for verses, the B side is good for choruses. So I'm going to play this example on the ride cymbal instead. These examples are good with your own exploration of them, um, but are a good way to start playing the drum set. Hope that helps. Thank you so much.